I'm going to try to explain how people normally grow at a company and maybe a better way to facilitate that growth. So basically, and normally, this is what happens in a company. So here you have the growth, and that's normally all the way up. And then here you have, you know, your people. You know, my awesome uh, drawing skills. These people have different kind of talents and different kind of skills. Um, the problem is that normally a company's growth is always going up, right? So, and going up means that being, for example, a team leader or a manager or a director, uh, VP, you know, C-level. And why is that? Because normally here, with the growth, is also where the money is, where the recognition is, even the learning opportunities, you know? Companies pay MBAs um, to their managers, right? or C-level people or VP-level people, but they don't have budget to train the low-level employees, right? Um, so this is what normally happens. So these people have different, different talents, different skills. Um, and at every level here, you need a different skill set. The thing is, because everyone wants to grow, and the only way to grow is basically going up this way, all these people that maybe they have talents for something else, they try to get into this path, right? Because that's the only way to grow. Well, what's a better way to do this? Um, you know, if you put a bit of these factors here, learning, the money, and the recognition, performance, all these things across the organization at different levels, then people can make use of their skills in the best possible way to help the organization and also go maybe in different directions, right? And not necessarily to be a manager or to be a director. So if you are able to do this, and of course, you know, you can give more responsibility as well, then not only your people will grow and will maximize their potential, but probably your company will grow much more too.